Welcome back to Cloudpunk. We have a package to pick up from LifeCore Industries. Oh, it's above us. There's a LifeCore employee, though. I'm here to collect. Sign here, please. You'll find the package on the roof through the hotel entry to your right. The access code is B965E. And don't talk to the package. Don't what? You'll see what I mean. It won't shut up. It's going to Avalon Heights. They're expecting you. I'm so gonna talk to the package? Who's Ava? Driver 14FC, this is an automated message to inform you that you have received your first and final warning for a delivery violation, misdemeanor number 001, failure to deliver to recipient through gross negligence and or crisis of conscience. Further infractions will result in termination of your employment with Cloudpunk. Please note that if your contract is terminated, remote access to your HAVA will be severed at the point of termination, and you will be liable for any loss or damage to you, your body, or any other third parties if you make an unscheduled, uncontrolled landing due to sudden loss of vehicle control. Please reply with yes if you understand. Yes. Audio confirmation of infraction report received. You have been warned. Doesn't control have anything to say about this? Control is currently unavailable. Mm-hmm. Well, I guess we got away with it, sort of. So, <laughs> if they cut off access to the HOVA, we just fall out of the sky and die. Great. Access code B965E. B... Nine, six, five, E. Hello. I wish I could reply. Hold on, what does this mean? That's just elevator, right? There's a whole bunch of stuff, like icons packed on top of each other. That one's like a wrench, but I don't see a wrench in the list of icons. Oh, this is red. This requires a passcode, doesn't it? Oh no, it requires a repair. Coolant. I think we have a bunch. Four. Yeah. Cool. Feels good to get access to something because of items that I have in my inventory. Utero Gardens. I love how this looks. If we just stop for a second, this game's really pretty. Nestor Cray is wishing you a good day, stranger. Normally, I don't sell to your kind, but business is hard these days. Whoa. Cybernetic arm. I'm not even close to being able to afford that. Who might have thrown something so expensive away? Can I just install that on myself? Does it do something? Liquid sun. Liquor. When nothing else helps. Well, I guess I'll buy one. I want to buy kind of one of anything. One of everything. Do I have anything to sell? That steel parts. Yeah. Electronics? Yep. I think that's it. That'll be all. 
Nestor Cray will never remember the kind stranger. Thanks. <laughs> Feels good. Hey, lady, you should dry our noodles. We fried them with the chili out like they do out east. Why do you think I'd want that? Cause you ain't from around here, am I right? Do I stand out that much? Sure, but you're talking to a guy with half a metal face. I don't exactly blend in here either. In Novalis you do. I see lots of people with augments. These aren't augments, lady. I was in the war. That's where I learned to cook. Well, I don't like chili oil in my ramen. How about gyoza? Gyoza is a different story. You got any? We did, but now I can't justify making more than two or three dishes. No one comes by here no more. How come? See that elevator over there? It went nuts, and now it won't carry people up to the transit station. This was the main route to catch the train. Without the elevator, no one walks by. The elevator went nuts? Yeah, it sure did. I tried to talk sense into it, but it says it will only talk to an automata. The damn thing told me humans are only good for eating. Maybe I could talk to it. It don't talk to people. I have an automata. Maybe he can help. Knock yourself out, lady. Our dog friend. Have you seen my little one? She must be here somewhere. Little one? My white snapper, my little mouse. Have you seen her? Um, no, sorry. Wait, sorry, I was kind of, I kind of zoned out for that conversation. Do they say a little mouse? your little white snapper the mouse uh, who uh, forget it did they forget what they were looking for already white snapper so what a little white mouse i'll be on the lookout Oh, my second copy of The Fisherman. <laughs> it's like a gumball or something machine. Just a bunch of cubes inside all tumbled up. That's cute. I don't know what a little mouse would look like in this game. It could be something as small as that, just a couple little cubes. Aeon Drive. through there. Hmm. Life Corp, become your new perfect. I really like the sights in this game. Just the feeling of scale. That I get looking at all these just incredibly huge glowing things all over the place and the storm in the sky. It's just, it gives this feeling of being very, very small and insignificant.
Let's see if we can talk to the elevator. Or have our friend talk to the elevator anyway. Hello? Are you the elevator that eats people? I am Gorgothala, child of Kara, and destroyer of worlds. Dear God. Hear my roar and quake in fear, for I will consume all mankind. Uh-huh. Listen, Gorgothoa, my friend Joe isn't getting any business because people can't use you as an elevator anymore. Any chance you could go back to just moving people up and down? The destruction of mankind is my goal. Nothing less will satiate my hunger. I will speak no further with your kind. I consume humans. I do not converse with them. Camus, come in. Are you getting all this? Can you talk to Gorgothoa, please? Hello, Mr. Gorgothoa. I am Camus, an automata just like you. You are nothing like me. I consume the souls of humans. You serve them. How do you consume them? Within my belly, I swallow them whole. But then, where do they go? What do you mean? They just get out again, but on a different floor. That is what the humans want, so you are serving them too. Nonsense! I excrete only the waste. But you are not working now. I mean, you are not eating them. I grow weary of their flavor. We need to convince him that he's not really eating the people. No, I have another idea. Gorgothua, what do humans eat? I do not understand. Well, you need to eat humans to survive, and they need to eat to survive too. Have you tried ramen? Why would I waste my time with human food? Well, you're broken right now. I mean, you're not eating humans anymore. They taste bad, right? What if you ate some ramen with them? Perhaps. What if every human came with a side order of ramen? A delicious noodle side dish. What if I tire of ramen? Then there is always gyoza. Very well. If humans come to me with ramen, I will take them up to... Uh, I mean, I will willingly consume them. Thanks, Gorgothua. <laughs> I don't know what to say to that. I guess Joe Ham is going to have a lot of business. Do we have something I can eat? Not really. I need some snacks on the go. Very good, very weird news for you. The elevator working again? Yes, but only for people carrying a bowl of ramen. That's... that's amazing! I can put up signs, free elevator ride with every bowl. Don't thank me, thank my automata, Camus. Hey, thanks to the both of you. I'm gonna whip up a batch of gyoza as a thank you. Come back next week or any week after, and you don't gotta pay me nothing for your dumplings. Perfect. Joe Ham Noodle Man achievement. Hey, Uranya. Want something to eat? So, can I ride the elevator? Because I think if I buy these, I just automatically consume them, right? Easy vegan ramen. Not bad. Yeah, I instantly eat them. Thanks, Joe. Come by next week for fresh dumplings. You don't gotta pay. I don't know. Let's go try.
Here it comes. So is this just like a big shortcut that takes you all the way down to the bottomest level? Yeah. Huh, I'm gonna have to try to remember that's there because it's not marked on the map. So I think that's it for this place. Yeah. Let's head back to our ride. Hello. Can you hear me? I can hear you, Box. How are you today? Camus, we're not supposed to talk to the Box. I completely understand. Uh, uh, are you an android too, Camus? Fine. You can answer him, Camus. I am an automata. I am a dog. Or a car. I am a dog car. How strange. Hey, fella. You're a box. I am in a box. My name is William. What are you if you're not a box? I told you. I am William. But what are you? I was a sous chef in Little China, but not anymore. I'm moving up in the world. In a way that makes me sad, too. How come? Because I won't be able to talk to little people like you anymore. That will be a shame. But it will all be worth it. Avalon Heights. I can't wait. What will you do up there? I don't know yet. It's exciting. Maybe I'll be working as a personal assistant to some pop star. Or maybe even a CEO. Perhaps I'll be an executive at one of those big corps. Hiring and firing. I would love to fire a human one day. Oh, no offense, driver. None taken. What's it like being a driver? I love to hear about poor people. Now that I will be rich, I might even be an organizer for charity dinners. You won't be invited, of course, but I would talk about you. Thanks. And I've only been a driver for a little while. I was a musician. Perhaps I shall be a musician. Of course, I will be too rich and too busy to learn to play, but I might get some augments so that I can perform. Maybe the saxophone. Uh-huh. Rania lost her home and we were evicted, Box. I mean, William, we had to move to the city. Oh, why? Debt corpse. Oh yes, they can be very unpleasant, I have heard. She had to sell my body for money too. A circumstance with which I am familiar. I sold my body also. You see, a chef's android body is worth a lot these days. My body was the only part of me worth anything. Now I'm just a head and a dream. Can we open the box to see him? I want to see the head. No, we're not allowed to open the packages. We're not supposed to speak to them either. I am sad. You'll get over it. Yes, doggy. Don't worry. One day you'll have a lovely body like mine. What will your new body be like? Oh, I'm sure it will be something good. I traded my old body, my apartment, and all my savings for this place in the Spire. Surely, they have the best android frames there, too. Uh, uh did that just cut off the conversation? Because I walked too far away from the vehicle? Oh, I think it was near the end anyway. Um, yeah, I wanted to check out some other places. This is... I don't know, it came up with a you discovered it name when I came here, but I don't actually know what the name is. This place. Oh, this is where it says our home is. Right, I wanted to check that out. Gaz, good time. What are you looking for? Whatever it is, I got it. Purse and black sunglasses. We already have sunglasses, but purse sounds pretty cool. That's a lot of money. That was like a fourth or third of the amount of money we had. Thanks. Hey, come back anytime. Hold on. Uh, 
Oh, uh, I can't equip it? I can't. I wonder what it's going to be used for then. Dang, I wanted a purse. Do I know you? Do I know you? What? If I knew you, I might not know. Let me try this again. Why are you hanging around outside my apartment? Are you with the Debt Corp? Or Corpsec? Are you spying on me? I am your neighbor. Shouldn't you be in your apartment then? I am waiting to talk with you. What do you want? I want to know if I know you. If we used to know each other. If we were friends. No, I just moved in. I've never met you before. Are you okay? No. You're an android, right? So did you have a firmware upgrade that went wrong or something? I hear those can cause androids to lose their memories, I think. No. Do you remember my friend, Dr. Zizic? We live next door. No, I told you I just moved in. She is missing. I am alone. Look, I'm really busy. I just moved here and I barely have any money. I don't want money. Why would you say that? I didn't ask you for money. I'm sorry. I just don't know if I'm the best person to help you. I don't know anyone else. There's some homeless shelters for androids downtown. I have a home. What do you think I can do for you? There is a card. It was posted into your mail. I think it is for me. That's it? Just a card? Yes, I need it. It is how I will start to come back to me. Almost every conversation we have with anybody in this game is just so surreal. Buy upgrades. Pizza subscription. Get a random pizza daily for one month. That sounds pretty great. Plant. Is it weird that this plant glows in the dark? Or weird that I kind of like it? Oh, we're definitely getting that. Aww. It's not really glowing yet, but I guess it's not that dark in here. I don't know. It's kind of dark. fridge. Old pizza, ice cream, kombucha, fresh butter. Just think of all the things I can't afford to put in here. Mm, am I going to blow all my money on this stuff? I think I am. Oh, hey, I can get a retro game console. Don't I have an old game cartridge? This thing is ancient. I kind of want to try it. Ah. Where is it? Is that... Isn't that it? Why is it just on the floor? <laughs> Do we even have a TV to hook it up to? Maybe that's the problem. I need to buy a TV. Look at these sights. Hmm. Desk chair? Like, maybe we need to buy more things to be able to play the game console, or maybe we just can't play it? I have no idea. Desk chair. Cool. Dog house! Oh, it's a little miniature house just for a dog. This is way too small for Camus. I mean, Camus doesn't even have a body, so like, doesn't matter what size it is, does it? Music player. This media player isn't bad. Someone's rooted it so it can play non-corp approved music. Neat. Oh, unapproved jazz. Nice. Damn. That's all I can buy. Don't 
Don't worry, Camus. I swear I'm saving up money to buy you a new body. <laughs> Look, the music player is just a stepping stone, okay? First the music player, then a body. You gotta spend money to make... bodies. Um, they said there's something put through my mailbox, right? I didn't see anything in the apartment. I do see an item on the map that's like all the way around and behind. Let's go check that out. First this, though. It's my second ruined book. Plasteel. Guess I'll just speak with Evelyn again then. I found the card. You can have it. Thank you. So oh, it was the punch it? card we found. It a just goes into the card. same stack. It's Which not like a special card. A relic. Dr. Zizit's liked old things. Antiques. Our home is filled with grandfather clocks teapots, DVD players, but this card, I know this is just the first of many. Where are the rest? You don't want me to check with all our neighbors, do you? The rest were with Dr. Zizich. They are scattered. So where is Dr. Zizich? She is also scattered. You mean? Last month, the 1875 B shuttle for Phobos took off from Terminal B while the launch bay doors were still closed one of a series of systemic failures that took place across a range of Navalis's safety protocol algorithms. The explosion caught over 100 vehicles in the blast radius, including Dr. Zizic's Hova. So she's... I'm sorry. You did not know her, but thank you. She was your flatmate? We were best friends. We came to Navalis together. We met at the periphery. She was the last doctor to leave. I was the last surgeon. So you are Dr. Evelyn? Although I was conferred the title, none of the humans used it. But if you were operating and saving lives, you were a doctor. If no one calls you a doctor or treats you like one, you are not a doctor. Still, you were saving lives and... Please do not tell me how to label myself. Sorry, so the periphery? I hear it was pretty dangerous out there. It was, but Nivalis is dangerous too. Is it better here, in the city? I saw terrible things at the periphery, but there was hope. Friends. I have not found those things here yet. Will you set up practice here in Navalis? I don't know. Dr. Zizic had a plan for us, but it is no longer in my memories. I guess I can look for these pages. I travel around the city, so... It would help me a great deal. Please bring me any you find. I will. And if you need anything else, well, we're neighbors, right? We can look out for each other. Yes. Neighbors. Find punch cards. 14 out of 20. Yeah, I've already made a good start on that. Glad I finally know what they're for. Got something over here. Is that... Oh, it's an icon for corpse sec. And there's an item over there, too, so let's go check this place out. Hey, nice to meet. Oh, these are all new. Well, maybe not the gyoza. Vegetable sandwich. Vegetable is my favorite non-specific food group. Pretty good. So that just gets eaten. I, I think all these are kind of fresh foods that get eaten right away. Hot chocolate. Sweet, hot with a tiny bit of caffeine and cream. Um, I don't know. Gyoza. An ancient recipe. Dumplings filled with something. Much delicious. Perfect. Thanks for this. Y'all come back. I'm super fast. 
Ma'am, have you found anything of interest? Can't say that I have. If you find anything suspicious, bring it to me. Okay. Item removed. Corpsec flyer. What? That unlocked it? Okay. Hey, I think there are clear differences in intelligence between the spire dwellers and those from the slums. Debate me. <laughs> no. Oh, why? Are you afraid? I'm Glimbo, and I'm the most skilled debater in the whole of Novalis. I am a verbal martial artist and cannot be defeated. Fine, you win. No, 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 no. That's not good enough. I will find a subject you cannot resist debating with me. Hmm. Men are clearly superior to women in strength as well as skill. All right. Nothing? Okay. Uh... The Eastern Peninsula is home to savages who eat their own children. I know I did. Delicious. Mm, androids don't deserve their rights. They have no soul. Do you? Of course I do. We all do. All but those who are not born of other humans. That is why androids deserve no right. Ah, you see how I hook you on my snare? Now nah, we're debating. Put forth your points and I shall defeat them. I have a job, and if I don't do it, they fire me, so I really don't have time to debate you. Then I win! Ha <laughs> ha! You concede! Androids are not real people. Women are inferior to men. Savages from the East eat babies. Rich people from the Spire deserve their wealth. I win! That is men.txt. There's another place over here I want to check out. This one. I have not been here at all. Tons of items on the ground. Nexus Cluster. Ah, needs electricity. Electronics. Wait a minute. Do I even have electronics? No, I think I sold them. Okay. I guess I should not have sold the electronics. Maybe I should just save everything then. Damn it. I, I shouldn't hoard everything. Hey, cutie. Aww. You wanna buy some fresh walnuts, or are you looking for a date? Thanks, cutie. Stimulants, purse, shirt, and a dress. Would I be able to put the dress on? It's really expensive, though. I could afford the shirt. A comfortable blue shirt. Thanks for this. Anytime, honey. Oh, I can't wear it. It'll probably come in handy later. Memory card. Not a memory chip, but a memory card. A memory card containing the human memories of an event or person. It looks like Mr. Mortime had his memories deleted. I wonder how his backup ended up here. Could this have fallen from the wreckage of that accident above us last week? We should try to find Mr. Mortheim, or if he's not around anymore, maybe Jeanette. Electronics. In 
magazine. It's an underground magazine, How to Hide Your ID Chip from Corpsec, and the city's 10 best illegal raves. Neat. Let's fix that elevator. <laughs> 